Loaded in is the magic number. Acids below and base is higher. Oh, oh. A pH meter uses probes. Measure conductivity of things you know. Oh, oh. Change colors. Litmus is most common. Red for acidic, blue for base, and neutral is a seven. Acids start with hydrogen unless they have some carbon. Let's party with the pH in the science lab. Yeah, we party with the pH in the science lab. Bases end with hydroxide. This fact is totally verified. Let's party with the pH in the science lab. Yeah, we party with the pH in the science lab. Or get them in your eye. Indicators include metal, orange, and red, litmus, and indigo carmen. Cause we party with the pH in the science lab. Yeah, we party with the pH in the science lab. And there's also blue bromothymol, and the one we can't pronounce to save our soul. Cause we party with the pH in the science lab. Yeah, we party with the pH in the science lab. So if you want to know which one you have, a universal indicator is your friend. Oh my god, we so love science class. Hydrogen and hydroxide cannot exist together in a solution, so they cancel each other out and form water in a process called neutralization. But what does pH stand for? Well, it means potential for hydrogen, or the balance between acids and bases. That doesn't make sense. Too bad. As it start with hydrogen, unless they have some carbon. Cause we party with the pH in the science lab, yeah, we party with the pH in the science lab. Bases end with hydroxide, this fact is totally verified. Cause we party with the pH in the science lab, yeah, we party with the pH in the science lab. So if you want to know which one you've got, just look to your pH scale. It might seem like a lot, but if you don't know this, you will fail. Fail! Like a little stressed. Just fine. Hey, what this pop pop is this? What?